Shalom. I to say all praises due to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekakwadash. Double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to the hopeful members of the elect. My name is Karnawak from GMS Toronto. This is in regards to uh, you no know, King Charles, the King Charles V of the Holy Roman Empire. Right, and uh, they have him like this picture. This was a uh, you know like this image is a I iconoclasm, right? Because this is not how he looked, right? But um, you know like that's what these Edomites did. You know they have Queen Charlotte Sophia. They have like a Edomite baby, but you know we know that King Jarl, uh that King uh, George the Third, he was a black man. All right, and uh, if you look at the uh, the penny, if you look at the whole uh, the Barbados uh, penny, you know it has uh, uh, the the has the depiction of uh, of King George III, you know, and um, I already made a lesson about that, so uh, you could watch that lesson. You know, because we were the stewards, you know, we were the nobles of uh, of Europe, you know, and through the world, because we had a, a major role, you know, we were, uh, it was a big monopoly because we were in power and we were doing a lot of, we were pulling a lot of strings, all right, and eventually uh, we fell on our uh on our high horse uh there's a book uh if you guys have it i already uh, i i'm sure that there's pdfs but uh there's a book called the portuguese jews of jamaica written by mordecai arbel all right this looks like uh I believe it's the amalekite but uh this goes into uh the history because uh we were in power man and uh, I'm going to show you this because the crown of Castile, they were, uh, you know, they were Christians or, or, or they were into the whole Catholicism and basically like they were going against uh, like the Muslims and uh, basically some of the Jews who were signed with the Muslims. Right, that's why um, that's why Granada was the lo the last more stronghold in uh, Spain. Then uh, some of them they went to Morocco because you know because there's a big stronghold in Morocco of uh, the Jews and the Muslims. All right, because our people were practicing that whole Catholicism or that uh, you know Protestant, you know. Um, this is a uh, crown of Castile. Uh, just you know, because uh, we were ruling in this region here, all right, Iberian Peninsula. You know, we had uh, you know we had Portugal and Spain, all right, and uh, they're the kingdom of the port of the Gauls, all right, like of port of the Gauls or Portugal. All right, because that's what the the gals, they were, uh, you know, the Celts. All right, um, you know, it's very, uh, you know, in depth. But uh, basically, they formed a uh, and they formed an alliance, and they got rid of the whole people that practice who's practicing that whole, that whole like Mohammedan like religion. All right, and. Um, Basically, uh, the last stronghold of Granada, right, was uh, was in Spain, and some of them they uh, because basically you had the Ottoman Turks, they came back to power, right? You had uh, those Ishmaelites and Jake who was siding along. That's why there's a whole Crusades. So basically, that's why the whole our people they came. You know to the new world and establish themselves throughout the uh, central america um the caribbean 
and as well as South America. All right. Um, it's very complex. We have a very complex history. That's why in uh, let's read this. All right, this they had succeeded by the Hashbury, the Hashburg, Spain. All right, it's the Kingdom of Castile, but Hashburg, Spain succeeded. Right, because uh, we we know that the that the king of that time was uh you know what this man all right you see he has a, a turban he has a like a like a a stone you know and uh basically uh you know he was uh reigning supreme and we and uh queen charlotte sophia she comes out of that line of the the hashburg hashburg dynasty all right so um we come from uh from royalty man you know from nobility all right and um that's why if you watch that that series on netflix queen charlotte sophia it's a very good uh it's a very good series yeah it's a very good series you know you should uh watch it man all right it's very educating there is a next series too uh, i believe it's uh the black tutors of england it goes into that you know so uh this is a very good uh read i'm gonna you know browse through but this is a very read you know for any uh people who like to read you know um these uh historical accounts you no know, because this is facts these are things that esau wants to hide all right because we were in power man uh, revelation 20 and 1 you know and uh basically esau he know that he has a short time left i believe it's revelation uh a short time left short time yeah let's get it revelation uh 12 verse 12 therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them woe to the inhabitants of the earth and the sea for the devil is come down unto you having great wrath because he knoweth that he have what a short time that's why he saw you know he's the uh having he's the basically the harbinger of death you know they're uh you know this this guy's polluting the air He's giving us, uh, you know, foodless food. You don't even know what the hell you're eating. You know, they're polluting our, our the whole water system. The, everything, man. Everything, man. He's he's the harbinger of death. He's causing, uh, you know, men to be, uh, to like to be women. Yeah, woman like who that want like turning man like oh, this guy this if the Lord doesn't come man if the Lord doesn't come man like no flesh that's why it says uh revelation I'm gonna get it I believe it's in uh it's in Mark let's get it Mark thirteen verse twenty Uh, Mark 13 verse 20 I'm highlight this and except those days shall be shortened those days except those days had had been shortened those days no flesh should be saved but for the Alexei who who he have chosen he have uh he have shortened the time so th he, that's why the the king Yahusha he has to shorten the time you know for the lexic all right because you know this the 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 the, the speed you know that these inamites is going on that they're trying to total control and they want and they want to basically depopulate you know as much people and it's going to happen regardless but you know they want to like try to destroy the elect man 
and Yahweh Shai, he has to step up and uh, he's going to step up and intervene. Right? And that's why his name is Yahi, um, Yahweh Shai, which means he is or he is to be. He is Savior. All right? So he is the one that's going to save us. All right. Yahi, yah, uh, Yahi, Ha, Washai is basically means to deliver. So he's the one that's going to have to deliver us from these, uh, these times that were these perilous times. I believe it's in Zechariah. No, Psalms. Uh, There's a scripture. Believe it's in uh, is this Psalm seventy four. It's not that scripture. Looking for a scripture. Hold on one second. I'm trying to figure out the scripture. Alright, because the Heavenly Father, he's going to have to intervene, man. Alright, the Lord, he, he like, he bringeth down one and sh and he set up, up another. Bring, to bring down, bring down one, bring down, I believe it's in Psalms. Cause he's the judge for Yahweh is the judge for God is the judge for Yahweh. Okay, God. Yeah, Psalm 75 verse seven. That's the one I was looking for. Psalm uh, 75 verse seven. But Yahweh is the judge. He put it down one and set up up another. So we know that, you know, these people that have the domain, right, that have the power, that have the crown, you know, the Lord's going to have to, he's, he, he's going to put them down, all right, because they're not ruling in righteousness, man. They're ruling in wickedness, you know, like treacherousness, you know, a whole bunch of deceitfulness, blood. Greed, you know, all kinds of things, right? And uh, the Lord, he, like, he hates, you know, a proud look, a double tongue, or lying tongue. You know, there's, because there's seven, like, there's seven things that the Lord hates, man. I believe one's a, a, a lying, a lying, uh, wait, a lying tongue, uh, double, uh, like a double-minded man. You know, so that's why you know you you that you Edomites man that you guys are the real, average the the Satan man the adversary man, you know who's who's basically governed who's governed, you know uh, that by the spiritual demon Satan, you know you damn Edomites that's in power man, cause you guys is, is destroying you know the whole family structure. Between man and woman, between fat, you know, between uh, children, you know, that's why Yahweh Shai he has to come, man. For it is the hat, for in the hand of the Lord, I have to drink some wine to this, all right, some yayan. For in the hand of the Lord, there is a cup, and the wine is red. And it is full of mixture and be and he poured out and he poured out the same but the dregs thereof all the wicked of the earth shall wring them out and drink them and that's what the heavenly father is going to do you know we're going to be drinking your blood all right like we're not going to be drinking your blood since like uh you know yeah like we're not like we're not cannibals you know, but this is spiritually, man. All right, we're gonna be drinking your blood, man. All right, because all, all the all, all your deceit, all your slander, 
and your your murder. You know, that Yahweh shot, he's coming back, man. Isaiah 63 and 1. Read Isaiah 63 and 1. I'm going to get that. But I will declare forever. I will sing the praise to Yahweh of my of my judge. All the horns of the wicked will be will will I cut off, and the horn of the righteous shall be exalted. And that's what the Lord is going to exalt, you know, with you know strength. All right, He's going to give us back, you know, you know, He's going to give us back that power, man. All right, because you have uh, the symbol of um, the monarch, you know, is with the horse and basically uh, the unicorn right and um that's basically judah and ephra all right because basically we were uh dwelling in the americas you know that's why we had up uh, colonies and you read about um uh, you know queen charlotte sophia all right she uh she had a colony in uh north north carolina you know there's a city called um called charlotte which is dedicated to a uh, to a black a negro uh, like a so-called black woman or right? a negro woman all right and um basically king george the second no stop it um king george the third his son he had a city in new brunswick that was dedicated to him that's called like fredericton all right, which was one of his sons. All right, so uh, this is a very good book, you know, or good uh, read, you know, off of this. Uh, I could share this link in the description, you know, because the Hashburg dynasty, we were in power, we we fell. All right, because uh basically we were uh you had uh the you is like a um is like the game of thrones because you had basically the hashberg dynasty then you had um it's like a whole confusion because like even though everybody were friends and stuff, but it's for power, right? These guys are fighting for power until we end up all losing the damn power, man. All right. Cause a lot of these, uh, these, uh, these kings, you know, these, uh, these people, these counts and stuff, they were Jews. Some of them were going to the synagogues, you know, and uh, no, no, some of them are going to these mosques, or ultimately, a lot of these guys they were involved into certain things, and basically it was like a monopoly, all right. And uh, you know, ultimately we fell, all right. Uh, you know, because um, I'm probably Lord's will. I'm gonna do a uh, uh, some history. I already uh the spirit's on it cuz um I have some uh some history about um one second one second um about the pirates, all right? You know, we watch this, the pirates of the Caribbean, right? With, like with Johnny Depp, all right? So the Hashburg dynasty, you know, King, uh, you know, Charles V, all right? The Holy Roman Empire, he was funding these stuff. So basically you had uh, the English and then you had the Spanish. Right, so that's why a lot of the people of uh, the Caribbean, especially Jamaica, they were, they were basically under Spanish rule, and they were and they were living good, you know, and that's why uh, a lot of those, uh, the whole slave raiding, 
you know a lot of the uh the pirates they uh they uh saved a lot of the people man all right and basically uh because a lot of our people are being put into captivity through the whole uh transatlantic slave trade through all the, uh, the caribbean brazil the americas so these guys were the pirates all right um i share this link in the description too all right there's a, also a book called the portuguese jews of jamaica you know this is a lot of uh history man you know i'm not gonna uh you know because you know like most because basically uh you know we had you know either might in captivity and um uh, basically there were a lot of uh you so-called amalekites because um a lot of germans you know who are israelites a lot of them came to the americas and as well as you uh so-called amalekites right you so-called ashkenazi that's why there's a lot of ashkenazi jews in jamaica the, throughout the caribbean throughout you know anywhere we are here you know you, like you always see their nose they always have that hook nose you know but uh you know basically uh there were shares so, so certain edomites they were prominent they had like you know probably like ten thousand share jake had like probably like thirty thousand like forty thousand so basically uh like that, that's how edomites got back his power right through the whole monopoly right because you had the jews they were the bankers they were uh the people of uh the finance and the whole uh the whole financial system right you know through all the amsterdam netherlands and all that is a big monopoly the whole slave trade um the whole uh the whole piracy or the buccaneer you know like it was a big thing and eventually the Yahweh Shai he had to save he, he he like he basically had to uh he had to put a a halt to it basically and uh we we fell all right um basically uh king george the third his son you know he became king george the fourth then i believe he died for like he only reigned for like probably like five like uh like 10 years or so and then he died mysteriously and then um you know one of his cousins you know which uh queen victoria or one of his sister i believe queen victoria she she came back to power but even might came to power i believe her uh queen victoria her husband was uh Al Albert or something, or, but basically, you know, that, that's when these Edomites came back to power. So you guys were really in power for like a a brief brief time. So you so you really have a short time to rule, man. All right. Um, get Isaiah sixty three and one. You could uh, I'm gonna share the these links in the description about uh you know the whole hashberg uh you know king charles the fifth and as well as um the whole uh the pirates right the sephardic pirates right of the caribbean right or the pirates of the caribbean right because we were torturing we were you you know and that's why um a lot of the a lot of the whole family crest right where uh where our found where our, where our ancestors were buried they had the whole the cross the cross bones all right and basically um uh, you know i come out on my mother's side we, we i come out of that line because we had that on our our family crest right the whole uh where bones of, of your rib all right and um you know uh basically uh you know we had family crests you know and basically we had power we knew you know like we always you know like we had a network we like we had uh you know we like we were very regal you know but you know we fell from that from that regal state man 
and and like and you know we're sorry he's gonna bring us back you know to that regal state you know and and we're gonna have everything done in order that's why he says um he has set up uh, he's gonna set up kings all right and priests right so you know a lot of uh our people a lot of the elect they're going to be kings all right we're out there no the elect is going to be kings all right our sons are going to be princes all right all right or priests all right and and we're going to we're going to show them how to be a king all right because a lot of these two-thirds they're going to have to die and come back and be born all right revelation 1 and 6 and has made us kings and priests unto yahweh and to his and his fa and his father to to him be glory and dominion forever amen behold he cometh with clouds and eve and every eye shall see him and they also which pierce him so the roman vent the roman centurions all right who 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 actually nailed yahweh shai on the cross you know like these guys are probably in some you know in the military you know some high high ranking military guys you know so you know so the heavenly father man it's like his son yahweh shai he's coming back and he he's gonna come with this host of angels you know and uh and they're gonna do damage man they're gonna do damage man all right, you can read uh, Isaiah 63 and 1. You know, who is this that cometh? Who, who is this that cometh from Edom with dyed garments from Basra? That is, that is, that is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength. I, I that speak in righteousness, might is save. Right, so Basra. Is a is a is like a Basra because you know that Basra was a place in in um over there in the land right uh you had you had the land of uh, Israel then you had the land of Moab yeah right, of um Edom you know and uh, Ammon all right Basra was like a capital of uh, es Esau but now the capital now would be like America. All right, who's uh who's very prompt now, who's very like they're uh they're very uh, affluent, you know. This is Babylon, man, who is drunken with the wine. Where where thou red in thine apparel and thy garments, like unto him that treadeth in the wine 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 fat. I have trodden the wine press alone, and and of the people there is none with me. For I will tread them in my anger and trample them in my fury, and their blood shall be sprinkled upon my garments, and I will stain on my rim. And that's what's gonna have to happen. That's what Yahweh Shai is gonna do. He's gonna come with his host, the angels, with his fathership. You know, the angel they're gonna, you know, because the angel they have different vehicles. But the in, but you know, but but his son, he, his son, the heavenly Father, his son. Right, he's coming with uh he's coming with the fathership, all right, and basically, you know, like the, the I'm like his son is just gonna be doing a bunch of destruction, man. So there's gonna be a lot of earthquakes, a lot of natural disasters, whole bunch of stuff, people getting zapped. You know. Uh, the whole uh, nuclear f explosions. There's gonna be a whole bunch of things going on, man. You're gonna have, uh, you know, these armies that's gonna try fight against the Lord, you know, but they're all gonna fail. For the day of vengeance is in my heart, and the year of my recompense to come. That's what's coming, man. So with that, I like to say a praise due to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim You know, um, I was inspired, man, of uh, the brother over there. Uh, the apostle or the elder apostle or slash elder you know uh yeah uh, i thought he was going into the whole uh the whole louis the 13th all right we like we drank uh louis the 13th one of the brothers he brought he brought louis the 13th all right uh 
you know and uh you know we really appreciate that man you know any brother if they have if they're able somebody bring it again man you know we could drink we you know hopefully the apostles could come to this could come to canada you know we could drink a, a louis the 13th man and you know because uh because we e e even though uh we talk on the phone you know we haven't even seen the apostles in 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 uh in in real life you know like we talk on the phone you know and uh you know through the videos and stuff man but you know when i when like when i was in jamaica i got to see a couple you know I, like i like i got to see the camp in gms uh kingston half a tree man so lord's drill man like you know when you have a shark comes man we're gonna be drinking that new wine man you know like it's gonna be better than that cognac or uh the louis the 13 we're gonna be drinking you know thousands year old uh wine man you know so with that let's say praise due to you how about shimmy how shy about shimmy kakodash apostles of great millstone peace and blessings the whole members of the leg shalom